Good morning, this is Dr. Jeannie Barrow with FearlessWomenAtWork.com and this morning is very dreary outside, so I'm shooting my video from my kitchen. And what I wanna share with you this morning is, I know uh, depending on what time of the year it is, companies have their bonus cycles and there are times when right before bonus times, companies decide to see who they are going to reorg um, out of the company. If you're one of those people who have been impacted by this, I want you to know that um, it's going to be a process of anger, resentment, uh, disbelief, grief. And so I equate losing a job or being reorged to having a loss, right? Losing something that was very meaningful to you your job, your livelihood, especially when you've been there for many, many years. So I just want to invite you during this time, and it really depends on your situation. Uh, so there are situations where you may feel that you need to get back to work immediately, and there are other times when you feel you may have a little leeway to think it over and ponder what you're going to do next. Either way, when you're ready and you want to take on exploring what you want to do next, I want to challenge you to ask yourself, despite all the stuff that you've been doing over the past however many years, what do I want to do next? What would light me up? And then try to match up your skill sets, qualities that you have about yourself with this desire to do something that would really light you up. Because this is a perfect opportunity to reset and a lot of my clients that I help uh, who have been out of work who are now looking for work again I realized that many of them haven't found what they're looking for because they haven't gotten very cleared as to what they want and most important how they contribute in a way that the recipient of the company that they're speaking with feels their energy and their passion and can see how much value this person's going to add to their team. So it's going to take um, time to figure that out. And when you do, you will find it very rewarding. I, I was in a situation where I had to choose uh, where do I, what do I do next and how do I want to contribute? And when I did that, I decided to start my own business. And I know that's a little drastic for m many people, but I'm just giving you an example of what can happen when you get clear on how you want to contribute. Now I'm going to run off to work on a statement of work for one of my clients, uh, whom I'll be working to do um, a lot of leadership development and we'll get to travel um, internationally, which is one of the things that I love to do. So there is light at the end of the tunnel and I'm sending you lots of positive energy and uh, inviting you to, if you're interested, check out one of the blogs that I recently wrote called How Focusing Can Make a World of Difference. It's at my website, fearlesswomenatwork.com, under the blogs, and it will give you three questions that you can ask yourself to help you get clear on what it is you need to tackle right now. So I'll talk to you soon, and leave me a comment if this resonates with you. Bye.